because I will break every bone in your body. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Not one more goddamn word. Am I clear? Okay. Okay. That's two bones right there. <coughs> We're gonna starve to death up here, Mr. Morgan. We're okay. We have a few cans of food and a rabbit. For what? 10, 12 people? When I was in the Navy... I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pearson. We were stranded at sea for 50 days. And you unfortunately survived. When we ran away from... Oh, he loves me, really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. Now shoot, get lost. Uh, well, see you gents later. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Navy rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you sane, it does. Yeah, oh. seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest that hand, Charles. We'll be fine in a few days. You mind help? Let's keep moving! You all right? Yeah, I'm good. What the hell was Bill doing? He had long enough to set that charge. Well, I hooked up the wire, but we won't mention that. You know what, Arthur Morgan? I'm a little old and beaten up to be after the biggest game. You can have this. What is it? It's a map. A man in a bar gave it to me. Well, I stole it from him, but that's another story. <laughs> Here. Here you go. You're a gentleman, sir. A gentleman. No, not really. I was just trying to impress the women. <laughs> well, anyway, thanks. Used to be known as the one-shot kid. <laughs> Okay. I'm not gonna ask why. You are a sad man, Arthur Morgan. But I know you love me. Desperately. You're my favorite parasite. No. Ringworm's my favorite parasite. You're my second favorite parasite. Very funny. I lied. Ringworm. Then rats with the plague. Then you. Shut up. This is the place now. Come on. Afternoon. Come on, girl. I know. Come on, let's get to camp. So you got the cash then? What cash? Yeah, there's usually some cash in the chimney. I'll check it. Rest of you boys get to camp quick. See, Arthur? I ain't so bad. <laughs> hey, Bill. You tell Dutch old Kieran ain't worth killing just yet. Yeah, right you are. <laughs> well, why ain't you never married? Goddamn animals! Who do you think you're talking to? Nobody. I'm talking to nobody. Did you say what? I said what did you say? Get lost, buddy. Shut up, mister. Yeah. Shut your mouth, mister. Had a good time, did you? <laughs> you going to get me out of here? I ain't decided yet. Real funny. Oh. Ain't joking, cowpoke. I heard so much bluster out of your mouth these last six months. And now, 
I got an opportunity to watch you be silenced. But you gotta do something. Why? I always looked up to you, Arthur. Well, that's your first mistake. Listen, compared... <laughs> Let's get out of here, come on! What the hell are you doing? He wasn't O'Driscoll. It ain't skinny, Micah, it's Norman. Oh. You always was a letdown, you fat sack of crap! Excuse me a minute, Arthur. Know we ain't intimate no more, and they'll know it was me. But you're fine with us robbing your cousin. By marriage. And yes, I'd love it. You heard the man. Let's go rob his cousin. By marriage. <laughs> and, and then they left. And then they jump back in again. Well, you know what? That taught me something. Stopping a train? Pain in the ass. Sure. But what if we could force a train to stop? <laughs> well, of course. We get a wagon full of something flammable, oil. Put it on the tracks. They see it. They know they either have to stop or die. Ain't no train driver wants to be cooked alive. That is kind of brilliant. Uh, for you. <laughs> that is a real idea. I think it's the first time you ever had one of them. <laughs> Shut up. You might be the first bastard to ever have half his brains eaten by a wolf and end up more intelligent. Oh. Whoa, Easy now. For Christ's sake. See, Arthur? Ain't that dumb. Next time, let the wolves eat all your brain. Then you'll be a genius. He'd be a damn idiot going anywhere near that town right now. Uh, he reckoned he'd be able to slip in and out. Oh, well, if it's John's idea, it must be a good one. What is it's gonna make it? You sure I can't just shoot him? No, did I not say that? You said plenty. Look at you two fellas all coming up! Ah. Idiot! Now get after the others, come on! Treat Well, I don't think he's dead. I think I won the fight. Oh, just a bad nice. thing. Please! Do what? Guys, fight this mamba. We must begin. They need me alive. This is no laughing matter, sir. My cousins are my primary concern right now. If everyone knows about Penelope and me... Everyone knows about Penelope and you? I know about Penelope and you, and I've been here all of ten minutes. Sooner 